What is up everyone, Xander here. Now that the bullshit kick drama has subsided, I decided that I'll be going back to reviewing modded kicks. So because modded kicks are like the most popular thing on my channel, I'm probably going to be doing this more often than other types of videos. I'll still be trying to make other types of videos and eventually I'll improve on them and stuff so that they'll be more enjoyable to watch. But for the most part, I'm probably just going to be doing modded kicks. By the way, if you guys have any suggestions for a modded kick I should review, you can kick me or put it in the comments or something. But don't give me a kick that's just a retheme. Give me a kick that's, you know, differentiates itself from other ones. Like if it has a certain feature that other ones don't or something like that. But yeah, um, the first kick that I'll be reviewing in a while, I guess, is Cyanite. It's a modified version of Pykeck. And for the most part, it has most of the features that Pykeck already has. But there's a few that um, I'll be showing you guys. And I'm going to cut this part out because this shit takes forever to do. Oh my god. Why do they make it like this? This is so dumb. Alright. Bullshit aside. Let's get right into the the, the kick. The kick. Alright. Um, Alright, so as you can see, it looks pretty much like Pie Kick. Or Knight, if you want to refer to that but there are a few small changes for example all the the modded kick settings are more organized instead of having them all on one page so you you either have to scroll down and shit they divided them into sections so there's appearance where is this oh um theme background media timestamps you get it all right this is the thing that makes this kick different from others under anti-spam you can see there's bot and op bot i'll get into that but actually no i have to get into that but what this does is it enables a bot obviously and i'll be getting into how you can get the bot and op it enables op commands you know if you've used Mat matrix then you know what op commands are but it allows you to use op commands either on this account or your bot account so um it even says at the bottom that it's recommended that you use these mods on an alt meaning you know the bot so all right, i'm going to disable these if you go they have two different apps one is for your main account one is for your bot account and i'm already in an account it seems all right cyanite bot and the bot last three right here are the main commands for the bot i'll probably just get into the op commands right now if you guys don't, in case you guys don't know what they are so if you guys type in bot help it tells you all about the bot commands using op and stuff Alright, if you guys don't know what- I should probably tell you guys what OP even means. Alright, if, if you don't know what OP is, it's basically like an admin, but it's like a sub-admin or whatever. Like, it has all the com it has all the privileges that admins have, but they can still be kicked and banned and all that, and demoted and stuff. But yeah, um, that's basically what they do. And you can pretty much OP anyone in the- in the you can, OP, you can pretty much OP everyone in the entire group if you want to. Although, I don't see the point in that. Alright, so there's three types of commands. There's head comms, OP comms, and bot comms. So let's try head comms. Hold on. Alright, this is what the, the, the real admins can use, these OP commands. These are how you can promote OPs and demote OPs and stuff. But there are other stuff like um, kicking, banning. You can ban phrases. So if somebody says a certain phrase then they'll get kicked or banned or something. OP comms. These are basically all the commands that OPs can use. Title is to change the group name. You know what? This pretty much tells you everything how do you do it and what they do and stuff, so I won't really tell you what they do. And then there's bot comms. Bot comms are basically for um playing games. Bot comms aren't like, you know, they don't do too much really. You can play a typing game. Um you can add a brick to the wall. I don't really know what that even means. I don't know. I can't. I can't really try that right now. Actually, yes, I can. I'll just make a group with that other account. All right. Okay. We're in a group now. So let's try brick. There's only one bricks in the wall. Keep building. What? Brick. Two bricks. I do not get what this is for. Um. If you guys know what this is for, you can put it in the comments or something, because I have no idea what this is useful for. Alright, let's try the typing game. Type. Type game off. 
type type game off okay well I am a noob I really don't know how to use these I should have probably researched this a little bit more but whatever um yeah that's basically all this has to offer but um as besides you know the regular pie kick commands and shit if you guys want me to review any more kicks or you know more kicks with more to offer then you guys feel free to let me know um this was basically just like a test because i haven't really reviewed a kick in a long time so um yeah if you guys enjoyed found this informative or if you want to use this kick i'll post the link in the description so you guys can download it for yourself it comes with both the main kick and the bot kick so yeah um i'll see you guys in the next video